Saturday as president of the Royal College of Nursing, this cheque for £10,593.18, and fourpence, which represents the uh, collections, the total of the collections that were made in the ABC circuit of cinemas. I think... <laughs> Of course, the, the real credit for this must go to the um, ever-generous British public, who always seem to uh, subscribe so generously to these worthy objects. At the same time, I think we must um, pay tribute to the help we had from the Nursing Association, from the Appeal Film and the uh, proximity, perhaps, of the film The Lady of the Lamp, in which Anna Neagle figured so prominently, and um, for the help from our own staff and everyone else who contributed so much. Lady Mountbatten, I have very much pleasure in handing you this. generousness, the enormousness of this check, and the uh, charming way in which Sir Philip has handed it to me, that I really hesitate to speak at all. But I think on behalf of the Royal College of Nursing, of the Educational Fund Appeal, of which I have the privilege to be president, and on behalf of all those who have nursing so much at heart, I would like to say to you, Sir Philip, and to all your colleagues in all those ventures in which you're associated in the film world, all that wonderful circuit of ABC cinemas who have, by their generosity, made it possible for our nurses and their colleagues to make collections from the public and to the public themselves, to say a very warm thank you. This check is another 300,000 to get <laughs> before we achieve our final goal because it is 500,000 that we need to set up this new department and this new scheme to help forward the higher grades of nursing. But I'd like to thank the public, the nurses very particularly, who never cease to support us. And I'd like to say that I am so particularly happy that the first engagement I've undertaken since I came back from a very long journey has been this happy event this evening at the Royal College of Mercy. Thank you all for coming here this evening. And thank you very especially, Sir Philip, for what you and all your colleagues have done for Mercy. Each one of us owe a deep debt of gratitude to the nursing profession. And I'm certain that as lay people, we are determined to get that 500,000 pounds, <laughs> of which half has been guaranteed by the nurses themselves. Thank you very much.